Good evening, everyone. T Speaker 222 XRP, future millionaire with a side button X. I'm in future. Did you but OG? So, I see a lot of questions already. What happened to DGB? Huh. I mean, DGB's at 5279. I bought it at 5364 or 5354. I don't understand. What do you mean, what happened to DGB? It's down 1%. I have a feeling, and I'm going with it, and I told you, worst case scenario, I'm not sweating this out. If DGB goes to two cents, I'll just buy a shitload more. So if you guys are riding it, have the common decency to buy it because you want it, not because I'm buying it. It's my long-term plan, after all, with DGB, if all went south, I would make no bones about it. But there's rumors that $9 trillion is going to be dumped in by the Fed. And I don't want to go through the emails, but if somebody, you know, I've, I've heard it by multiple people, and that's my gut feeling. That's telling me we have to be in this before 2000, or before uh, the 13th of June. Because they're going to start pumping it, and this thing could go crazy for a day. But then by Tuesday, Wednesday, it's going to outright collapse. So that's why I'm positioning myself. If it's all bullshit, well, so be it. But I'm going to coin that I'm, I'm going to fucking... Who knows how many times X from this point. So what do I care if it goes from five fucking cents to three? I'll, I'll buy a shit more and then I'll just be all in on DGB and then I'll have my XLM and then my... Uh, at the end of the day, if I only have my DGB and XLM, whatever. XRP, I got 2000 in the storage wallet. The cold wallet. So if I never bought another XRP, so be it. I would transfer half of my DGB out at some point and buy XLM with it. If it went down that road, that's all I would do. <laughs> because if DGB was going down, XLM would be going down, so I'm not losing anything. But I wouldn't keep it in if it was gonna have an outright class, but I'm telling you guys, like, some of the questions though is exactly why I'm switching my, my way of doing things. Cause look, all these people jumping down my throat already, and don't take offense to it if you're not one of the people I'm talking about. If you think you're one of the people, but you're an OG, you're not one of the people. But the people that are telling me, hey, uh, and I deleted a bunch of comments, guys, so you didn't have to deal with it. I don't have to deal with it. A bunch of people are telling me, oh, well, Tom, you said DGB wasn't going to go down at all. Like, what the fuck are you? I said it's a gamble, and how am I going to know if it's going to go down? I've taken gambles, and DGB would be at 5354 when I bought it, and it wouldn't start doing anything until it got to 49, and then it turns around. Like, I don't fucking know if I was a wizard, maybe. So, but that's why I am doing what I'm doing. I put out this information. I tell you exactly what's going to happen. And then I get ridiculed for the next hour, you know, for the last hour, because it simply went down to five, three, two, three, or five, two, seven, seven. Like you guys know what a gamble means. And furthermore, if you can't take a 1% loss and your heart doesn't stop, what are you going to do when this is down six and a half percent? And I'm still riding it potentially. I mean, so that's why I said it's my gamble. If you want to take it, don't blame me. And like the fact I'm even saying this right now just solidifies what I'm talking about in this community. Like listen to what I'm saying in my videos. In a bailout plan, you should ask yourself how much are you willing to lose? I did say in a video, if it broke this part right here, we can't break this bottom. So if you see it break below like 5.2, 5.18, well, that's when I would, you know, probably say we might have to get out. Because if we're playing this bounce, and we're playing it to come up on a pump, which is exactly what it's lined up for if you look at it. <coughs> so I said the way this is falling doesn't feel right. Normally with this kind of volume, it would have just collapsed. So even with that low volume, it feels like they were pumping it in just enough to keep it going. For whatever they're planning on doing and if it's nine trillion or eight trillion well that would make sense and then i'd expect it to immediately pump tuesday or wednesday i mean uh to uh, dump on tuesday or wednesday so i honestly think we have a pump coming imminently i really do i could be wrong this intel could be horseshit but i've heard it from more than one source more than 10 sources so after a while, you got to put some stock into it. So, T Speaker 222 XRP, future millionaire with the side bet on XLM and future. Did you buy OG? 
If you're an XRP, just know if it falls below 78 cents, why would you be in it? That means we're probably going to go retest the lower support. So I made no bones about it. This is a tricky situation, and but I know other reason than a gut feeling. So it is what it is.